Hi, I'm Terry Musser. And I'm Kelly Musser. And we're trying our first virtual tour. I've done many videos over the last 33 years I've been in the business, but this is something brand new to me and to Kelly. So welcome to our first virtual open house. Um, we're gonna wait a couple minutes for some more people to get into the room. You guys can comment as we go through. We do have someone that's gonna be monitoring, so if you have any questions that we don't answer during the tour, we can make sure to get you them answers after. So, so yeah, welcome. Yay, apparently we're live. All right, this is great. I guess we really didn't even rehearse anything. Off the cuff. <laughs> but basically, it's a great house. We've been through it. Kelly's been through it many times. There's a lot of unique features you're gonna see with the bathrooms and kitchens and things, but we're gonna discuss uh, that, that as we go along. With all the COVID-19 restrictions, we figured this is a nice way to do virtual open houses for you guys. And we've actually been doing listing presentations and appointments like this as well, along with um, virtual tour showings with sellers. So if you guys have any questions, if you guys want to plan to do a listing meeting where we talk about stuff, let us know and we can show you the new technology that we're using to keep up to date on everything. We recently joined Compass and part of it was the technology, so we're trying to, trying to utilize whatever we can. But we do want to be safe. That's our number one goal. We're practicing as much as this as we can. So we're moving with the future and right. rolling with the punches, so to speak. So these are trying times. I'll try to be funnier and make this interesting. But basically, not me. I'm boring. <laughs> we don't. We, want, we don't want to do anything. Uh, in today's world, you know, we all have to bond together. So I'm really looking forward to maybe doing this a little bit more in the future, keeping everybody safe, but still trying to perform some services for our buyers and sellers out there, uh, but abiding by all the rules as well. I think we're ready to start the tour. We have enough of you watching. You guys ready? Yeah, I think you're ready. We can All always right. run the tour a second yeah, time, too. Yeah, true. So we're going to begin our virtual tour. And like I said, if you guys have any questions, we'll answer them. So welcome to 219 Holstein Road, King of Prussia, PA, 19406. It's an expanded Cape Cod with central air. There is, right here, five bedrooms, four full bathrooms, and 2,200 square feet above ground in Upper Marion School District. And the cool thing I liked is they modernized a lot of things you'll see, but they did it in a nice, tasteful manner. We have an acre of land here, as you can see, plenty of space for entertaining. The sellers actually installed a six-foot vinyl fence that they recently power washed as well. You can see the privacy fence here. Very much maintenance-free, which is what we yep. all love today. Six-plus six car parking, as you can see. Um, they have French doors for the deck and patio area. Here's a little side view. And with that parking, you'll see a shed that they can also use as a garage someday if you yep. opted to. So there's an extra wide shed. Um, it's going to come up in the next shot. It's actually on a stone foundation. So you can see right here the patio and the deck. Right there is part of the shed, and here it is. So that's actually fixed on a stone foundation that will be staying with the property. So now we're going to take a look inside. Beautiful stonework. Beautiful hardwood floors. So here's the family room. It's a propane fireplace right there. They have hardwood floors throughout the entire first floor, except for the first floor master ensuite. Breakfast areas you see, custom cabinet cat custom kitchen cabinetry with granite countertops and stainless steel appliances. And there is an eating area inside the kitchen, so you do have a Yep, the breakfast area is about 10 by 10, and then we have the kitchen that's 12 by 10. So here's the first master. The first floor master with a little kitchenette on the right, granite countertops as well, stone flooring. So you can take a look around. This is actually 17 by 19. And it is on the first floor, like she, they said, so many yep. people today looking for that. Thing. Yep. There's a first floor bathroom that's going to come up on the left. That's actually six by eight. And then we're going to come take another tour through the kitchen. As you can see, another angle looping around right here. Granite countertops, eating and kitchen area. There's a little desk area that they had built, little workspace. So this family room is actually 13 by 22. I know I told you guys it's a propane fireplace. 
We have a coat closet here to our left, and then they refinish the hardwood floors as we go upstairs. And all, all the paint, I feel, fits in very well with Yep, it. they actually repainted. So the master bedroom with ensuite has hardwood floors as well. There's a walk-in closet to your left, and you can see the laundry area to your right. They so, wanted to have one up on the floor where all the laundry is, yep. so that's why they did that there. Tiled bathroom with a jetted soaking tub and skylights, as you can see, and then a walk-in tiled shower that actually has waterfall features. I have a whole list of waterfall features for that one. It is really cool. I never yeah, saw anything they did a like really it. Yeah, nice job. So then we're going to follow into the first bedroom. So this one is 14 by 10. Again, freshly painted hardwood floors. You can see the closet. And then the second bedroom is 12 by 19. Again, hardwood floors, closet. And then this is the full bathroom that's six by seven, tiled with the linen cabinets to your left, as you can see. So now we're following into the basement. So they refinished the hardwood steps here and did tiled flooring. This has its own family area, desk area, as you can see. The double white doors is your utility closet. And then we're going into the kitchenette area that has a propane dryer as well, and it's a washer. And you have a separate entrance right there with the door that goes out yeah. ground level. So the bedroom here is eight by nine, and then the family room is 11 by 10. This is a custom tiled bathroom with a walk-in shower full, and then that's eight by five. So your entire home is over 2,800 square feet. It's a and great location, <laughs> you know, just minutes to King of Prussia, literally the uh, exits like what maybe two minutes from their house yeah literally mass transit is two minutes ardmore is five minutes away so you're right off of the main line there is the brand new gulf elementary school that is very close by as well um and then you also have a train station close by too they're by the gulf mills train station so superb location Really cool house. I mean, we don't get to see a lot of capes anymore. No, an and a, not an expanded cape car. And then b being fixed up like this, and I'm getting so many people requesting that first floor, you know, master bedroom idea. But here you have three. You have three bedroom. master bedrooms. And who knows, with today's lifestyle, we're seeing a lot of multifamilies coming together or living together just because yep. of... Uh, Socially, everything going on and economically too. Yeah, and then the taxes are only fifty two oh two for the year, so very good taxes for the size property that you would have. <laughs> but you know, if you have any questions, you can send them in. Yep. Obviously, and uh, we're actually doing individual tours as well with sellers, but only video and virtual. We don't have any actual physical tours yet. We're waiting until the government lifts everything. But we do have some alternative ways. Like I said, we're doing video tours for now. We have virtual, you know, walkthroughs, and we are doing virtual listing appointments just like this open house. Thank you for coming. And if you guys have any questions, just feel free to give us a call. No, that sounds great. All right. See you later, guys. Hey, thanks a lot. Thanks for joining us. Hopefully, we'll be seeing you soon.